Peace, love, and light, Cantarians. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose. Cantarians, thank you for all your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. We are on the road to 10K. Thank you for your support and getting there. Personal readings are being done at this time. All information can be found in the description box as well as the community tab. Let's get into your messages. Let's check to see what's in your energy. Cancerians. Messages for Cancerians. Huh. See you at the crossroads, crossroads. See you at the crossroads. See you at the crossroads, crossroads. Hmm. Um, someone's see you at the crossroads. It's like someone's energy who's like a like a loved one or something that's passed. <clears throat> um, that's the energy of like a loved one that's passed, like um. Uh, that's showing up this may be a female figure um, hmm. this may be a female female figure that a loved one 242 it's like a, a waving a wavering decision like an energy of someone who has transitioned like a decision this is a reunion this is also an energy of like uh see it's like all this cosmic energy showing up this person is um trying to tell you that uh something about their transition It's a it's some it's some female figure. A lot of feminine energy. A lot of feminine energy. Like you may be, you may be this person's like a you may be a family member of this person. A um, lot of feminine energy. Star card. It's like uh, this person's trying to tell you that they're connected to you. Um, there may be something that this person wants you to know that you may not be seeing like this eight of cups mm, okay this eight of cups is confirmation of a truth seek seeker seeking truth seeking energy someone's trying to let you see the light of some situation uh there's something that that's going to come out perhaps that has not been revealed yet something that's going to be seen that hasn't been seen yet perhaps this person is wanting you to see this perhaps they're wanting you to connect to this truth again truth seeking energy this person may be wanting you to investigate something look further into something um hmm. father of fire there may be a king of wands okay so um seeing the number two show up this uh this ancestor figure is, is wanting you to access your your high priestess energy there's something that you don't see Hmm. Something you don't see. Something powerful. Something perhaps within you that you're not seeing. Uh. Hmm. Something that this ancestor figure, high priestess. Hmm. Hmm. There's something you're trying, it's like someone's, 
It's like someone's trying to tell you something. Stop searching for the answers, meaning, and power everywhere but inside yourself. The powerful high priestess ancestor comes forward to say that it's time to go within. There's something that you know that you may even have been in denial about for a long time. So there may be something that you know that you're in denial about. Mm, that's double confirmation, triple in fact. Something you may be in denial about that you're... That you know. Something that you know but you're in denial about. What are you... What do you know? Uh, it says, you're a child of the moon connected to infinite intelligence. Remember that. So are you in denial of this? So this ancestor is, is, is speaking to you. This ancestor may have also been a high priestess and this ancestor is wanting you to get your ish together point blank period <laughs> uh again there's something that you know that you may have been in denial about for a long time mm. so <clears throat> this is you being in denial being at the crossroads this four also is an energy of manifestation and it's interesting that this is also an energy of manifestation this ancestor could be reminding you that there the thing that you need is is it's closer than you think it's like uh you see how this high priestess literally holds the moon in her hand this is high priestess goddess hathor you may this ancestor may walk with you as well this is um hathor i believe is the greek name for this uh comedic high priestess mm. There's something that you may not know that you need to know about and you're looking for the answers for this thing outside of yourself. When this ancestor is clearly telling you that everything that you need, you hold it in your hand, like you holding on to this moon. The moon represents Aidawedo. This is the queen of the unknown, of what is unknown. whatever you're you're going outside of yourself to look for you already know it that's that's what this ancestor is trying to tell you whatever you're going outside of yourself to find you already know it you have access you have more than access it may be something about some connection or it could just be connecting back to self which is this um lover's energy yeah this is this is a clarity that you're looking for and you get to connect back to yourself to get it like get back to yourself some of you your spirit guides are telling you like you you have a blindfold on and it, it could be from something it could be a result of a past connection it could be something that you're not seeing about a particular connection that is uh like some some partnership something with someone that you may not be seeing and you're looking for the truth and you're gonna find the truth about this connection it may be something about this connection that you're seeking to find and your spirit guides are telling you what are you what are you going outside of yourself for why are you looking for you know some of you are getting readings some of you are getting readings some of you are listening to tarot readers about something that you already know the answer to <clears throat> two of swords <clears throat> mm, something some some cup situation that caused some um, mishap 
a blockage that you're looking to see what is the cause of it you're wanting to know what's causing it what's what's how is that um why is it happening why do you have this blockage this blockage is represented by the two of swords and this ace of cups in reverse something is blocked it could be some emotions for some of you um it may have to do with like a, a physical womb or a spiritual womb something that you're wanting to give birth to something that you're wanting to manifest something you've been working on that you may not be seeing the results and your spirit guides are telling you that there's an opportunity being shown to you and this opportunity starts with you being connected with whatever you're in denial about this is you coming to the decision that what you see is exactly what it is it's it's you trusting yourself this is also that connection to the heart chakra energy again uh knight of swords like You, you may be in an energy of like being kind of like wishy-washy. Um, and <clears throat> your spirit guides, something about your throat chakra. Someone may not be wanting you to speak something, say something. Mm, something about this, um, this conjurer as well could be significant. Someone's doing something. Someone's trying to possibly keep you from seeing the truth about something about possibly a connection someone may actually be influencing your decision to refuse a connection a connection to yourself for some of you this could be a connection to um a relationship there's someone influencing this it's like a ongoing thing someone's doing something what else do you want us to know yeah, you're dealing with someone who's a hypocrite. Someone who's not really real and true about what they're doing. Uh, oof. Ooh, look at that. A mother figure. This came out for you before. It's a mother figure doing something. A hypocrite. This mother figure is a hypocrite. Dang. I'm seeing you're going to win this battle. Some of you, you could be getting the ringing of the ears. Whatever this mother figure is doing, it's it's meant to like prevent some connection from happening. It's meant to prevent some kind of connection from happening. There's there's something that this person is doing that you're gonna obviously like overcome. Um, and I'm also seeing that your spirit guides are. Mm, Now, why was I getting that energy about this someone talking about seeing you at the crossroads? It's like someone someone could actually be trying to keep you stuck there. I'm seeing that there's a spirit guide that's also wanting you to know this, that someone's trying to keep you stuck. And it really could be this um, like this mother figure that's showing up here. Uh again watch i'm hearing this mother figure is a hypocrite sheesh look at that like this may be a water sign cancer pisces scorpio energy dang tell me about this conjure woman yeah this 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 is a water sign this is this is the bitch that won't quit that's what i'm hearing Excuse the French. That's exactly what I'm hearing. This person's like, see, this is the energy of a stuck road. This the stuck road, yeah, like crossroads. This is the road that is stuck. Whatever you're supposed to enter into, cross into, someone's blocking that. Someone's there. This conjure woman. Yeah, they, they conjure and they're doing stuff. Trying to get you going backwards instead of moving forward. Like, I'm seeing here, though, uh, whatever, 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 this person's not going to win. Point blank, period. They're not going to win. Mm. 
they're trying to throw you out of alignment Ooh, you also have a very powerful spirit guides that your um your spirit guides are wanting you to know that there's a powerful spirit guide that walk with you this is aida wedo energy they're trying they're telling you that there is something coming there's a there's a rebirth there's a, a new thing happening and i'm also seeing that many of you may have had like an ancestor female figure that transition your spirit guides are wanting you to know that this person's actually coming back see five five confirmation your spirit guides are wanting you to know to pay attention to the numbers there's someone trying to betray you and you also have someone uh you have an energy a spirit guide working alchemizing to put things back into alignment I, uh, all i keep hearing is this mother figure is a hypocrite mm. uh Mkosazana is the healer of healers and the teacher of teachers whose love for humanity makes the corn grow. She dwells in foamy waters but is known as the heavenly princess as above so below. Your natural path is to be in alignment with your own divinity. No one can take from you what they didn't give you. Take that. <laughs> okay. Um, celestial alignment is being in sync with the energetic feeling frequency of the sacred everything that you desire is in that frequency match it with your feeling that is the energy of goddess goddess declaration i'm always being guided in the right direction yep this is why the high priestess showed up because whatever's promised to you is going to be given to you this radical rebirth five five change it's happening now this person better be careful because this is also oya energy this is like she 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 gonna get fried by oya's lightning the declaration here is still i rise it says yes you can stop the struggle you can choose at any moment to start over and be reborn like the sun you rise again and again it's interesting that aida wedo showed up in this and this energy and dumbala wedo is showing up here the sun this is a connection it's showing up as a connection, 5-5, five, five, a twin flame connection. And this mother figure is trying to, like, destroy this twin flame connection. This is why this four of wands is here. They're trying to stop it. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, indeed, the bitch that won't quit. Uh, the goddess declaration is still I rise. So get your, get your ish together, okay? Um, do your spiritual work. Because this person doesn't stand a chance. Although they think they do. Again, you're being reminded by your spirit guides. No one can take from you what they didn't give you. That is the message. Cancerians, if this message resonates, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time, love, peace, divine light.